Sis, if every time you do your makeup, you look in the mirror and something looks off, you can just never get it to look perfect, then I'm about to put you on to the top makeup tips that literally changed my makeup. My makeup was looking horrible before this. Number one, you do not need a ton of makeup to get a fully covered flawless base. Like you just do not. Start out by covering any marks on your face with a little bit of full coverage concealer and then let that sit on your face and let it dry down. This way you can actually pinpoint the exact places on your face that need coverage instead of caking on multiple, multiple layers of foundation. This is no hate to my girlies who love a good cake on layered on foundation vibe like I love you guys I personally love that as well but for my everyday I don't like my makeup to look super cakey so covering specific spots is going to allow you to use less foundation and foundation layered on gets cakey Mary Phillips little underpainting thing is really that girl I find that it honestly is the best way to apply your makeup and not have it be cakey like I don't like a cakey base and this is the best way by far Going back to the little spots that we covered up with concealer, you're literally going to tap around in circle motions, circular motions, just to blend out the product, but you're not going to go over the actual bump. You want to leave the product on the bump, but just blend it out around, if that makes sense. You guys, this one is top tier. Using a concealer as your bronzer shade because there's coverage in a concealer very high coverage in a concealer so if you use it as your bronzer my problem area where i experience darkness and most of my like pimples and stuff like that is on my cheeks i'm adding extra coverage while not having to layer on more of a regular colored concealer so that it cakes up i'll blend out every product on my face either with my fingers or a brush never with the sponge anymore i just find that it looks so much better so much just I, I don't know it just looks so much better when you do it with a brush opposed to a sponge this rare beauty brush has literally changed the game for me when it comes to blending out my concealer the shape sorry it's so dirty it fits so well in between here and it just blends it out like stunningly i also urge you to stop using such matte foundations and matte concealers like i know i know i know the oily girls are gonna bully me but like I have oily skin too, and I also used to be a matte girly, I used to be addicted to it, but it just doesn't look as good, in my personal opinion. Please, please set your under eye with a pressed powder first. I promise you, it's going to make the world of a difference. Okay, I ran out of time, so I had to just do the rest, but my last tip is waterproof mascara. If your eyelashes are always falling down, then you need a waterproof mascara, girl. You need it because it's gonna hold your curl all day long, I promise. If you need a part two, let me know. I have tons more tips.